Hey guys, Jim from Measure Square here. Welcome to part 5 of the Takeoff Tutorials and the Getting Started series for Measure Square 8. In this video, we will cover drawing an arc into a wall. To begin, I will select our free draw mode. I will begin drawing my room. Now, once I am at the point that I am ready to draw my arc, I will tap the R key on my keyboard. You will see the arc tool appear above my mouse. Now, when I do my next left click, you will see the arc is now forming on the screen. Now, the second left click will cement the arc in the shape it is currently in, and then, then you will be able to continue drawing in the free draw mode. So, left click, you'll see the arc is now on the screen. Now, I can finish drawing my room. This tool also works the same way when we are drawing a divider elevation, line segments, and so forth. Now if we already have an object drawn and we need to add a curve or arc to it, we will use our set arc tool to do so. So I will draw a divider line right here. And I'm also going to draw a hole and I will show you how to adjust each of these shapes using our set arc tool. So I'll insert a hole here as well. Now I'll go to the top right of my screen, select Set Arc. You'll see an arc on the mouse again. And now when I bring my mouse over to a wall, you will see those bullet points pop up on the various shapes. Now I can left click and hold on one of those red bullet points, drag it out. Once I release my mouse, my arc will be set into that location. Same thing will work for this divider line. I will left click and hold on that bullet point drag out the arc, let go once I am done with my left mouse. I'll go over to this hole right here that I just drew. I will left click and hold on that bullet point, drag this up, let go of my mouse, and now that arc is drawn within that hole as well. In the next video, we will cover aligning our rooms and then adding doorways into them.